The exhibition at the Tate Gallery in 2007 on the uh, Pre-Raphaelite artist John Everett Millet um, opened a lot of uh, people's eyes to uh, his later work and um, over the last 30 years I've been quite interested in um, Sir John Everett Millet's uh, later landscape paintings uh, which were painted in Tayside in Perthshire and uh, as long ago as 1978 I went up to Perthshire to photograph some of the landscapes from which he painted as they are today. Some of the scenes are remarkably uh, the same and have changed very very little in the um, 130 years or so since uh, uh, Chill October was painted. So uh, I have shown in, in this Flickr site uh, a number of my working photographs from the landscapes and uh, the places that I have visited. It will give you a little bit of an insight into how an artist looks at a landscape and uh, how an artist may adapt that landscape uh, for their own purposes. Uh, you can see this particularly in some of, in the garden painting, the, the painting of the old garden at Merthley Castle, how um, uh, Sir John Millet um, moved the fountain uh, to create a, a more harmonious composition. Whereas others are, are, are remarkably uncomposed in a way and um, uh, feature a wild moorland and um, uh, peat bogs and uh, marshy ground, um, all of which uh, I tried to capture in some of my photographs, uh, which I'm showing here on Flickr.